Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this Python tutorial, we are going to learn about reading Excel files uh, with XLRD library. Uh, both we will read both XLS and XLSX file. So first we will import uh, or uh, we will install uh, XLRD. So for that I will come to this terminal and I will use pip install xlrd equals 1.2.0 because the latest version of xlrd does not support xlsx file files so we will use this uh, version 1.2.0 this is an old version and this support both xls and xlsx files so i'll click enter so it will take some time to uh, get this uh, now it has uh, imported this XLRD uh, or uh, installed this XLRD so I'll now import it so I'll use import XLRD the second one now as this is imported so I will you, uh, show you the XLSX file so this sample one dot XLSX file we have uh, 1000 records inside this so we will read this file now if I show you, I'll go to the top and show you this. Now you can see we have this uh, name, names as well as this country and gender and as uh, this numbers. So we will read all of them. So now I'll uh, minimize this. So now we will get the workbook. So I'll use uh, wb equals uh, xlrd dot uh, open underscore workbook and now here it will take the path so i will go here and uh, i'll go to downloads because is this file is uh, in downloads so this is our file sample one so i'll right click on this and go to um, its uh, show more properties and now here i'll copy this path so I'll copy this path control C this and uh, now I'll come to editor and control paste this with this and I'll use backslash and here I will use a uh, sample one dot this one and now I'll use a backslash here as well so this error will be gone now we have the workbook so now as we have the workbook so we will get the sheet from it so um, i'll use ws per worksheet equals wb dot sheet by index and now i'll use zero here because we have only one sheet in our workbook so now to get the rows and columns so we will use for loop so far um, i in range and i will use uh, uh, ws dot n rows first we will use rows then for j n range and now we will use ws dot uh, n uh, columns and now we will print the rows and columns so I'll use print and we will use um, ws dot uh, cell value um, i comma j and here I will use comma end equals and double quotes or single quote backslash t and now we will print uh, an empty space print and double quotes single quote so so now let's run this and check this if it is working so if i run this now you can see that it is reading all the data from this xls x file sample one 
now i also have a sample one a sample a file which is only xls um, if I show you it is uh, inside the downloads also now this is the sample xls file so now we will try to read th uh, this one with this same code so I'll remove this uh, x from the end and I will use uh, uh, remove this one and I will use e here so this is uh, sample.xls file now it has the same data as this one so if I delete this and rerun this now you can see that it is reading the xls file as well so that's all part today I hope you like the video if you like the video please like subscribe and comment thank you